A California fire captain's son accused of opening fire on a couple in a random attack kidnapped a 19-year-old woman and tried to rape her before dumping her body in a field. Gabriel Esparza, 20, pleaded not guilty last week to seven counts, including kidnapping, attempted rape, and murder in the death of Andrea Vasquez. He was also charged with the attempted murder of the woman's 19-year-old boyfriend. Mm. Other charges against Esparza, Esparza, I mean, include special circumstance allegations of murder during the course of a kidnapping and murder during the course of an attempted rape, as well as the allegation he personally used a rifle while committing the crimes. Our hearts ache for the devastating loss of a young life to the heinous nature of this crime involving the murder, kidnapping, and attempted rape of an innocent young woman shots our community to its core, Gascon said. The DA vowed to work tirelessly to hold Esparza accountable for his callous actions. Esparza's attorney, Ambrosia Rodriguez, described his client as a good kid from a good family whose father is a Los Angeles County Fire Department captain. Everyone in this case is in shock, and everyone who knows him can't believe that he has been charged with this crime. Adding that Esparza was scared and only beginning to understand what is happening. Following Esparza's arraignment, Wednesday, Vasquez's mother, Anna, told reporters that she demands justice for her daughter, who she said was just starting out her life. She, let's see, Andrea Vasquez was a rising sophomore at Fullerton College, where she was studying fashion. Since after midnight on August 20th, Vasquez and her boyfriend were standing outside their car parked in Penn Park in the Los Angeles suburb of Whittier when prosecutors said as far as approached them and opened fire with a rifle. Vasquez's boyfriend ran for help. As far as allegedly kidnapped Vasquez, and took off with her in the bed of his pickup truck. Her boyfriend ran for help. See, just left her. Man, what the... F Jeez, bruh. He drove her to a remote area of Moreno Valley in Riverside County where he attempted to rape her before dumping her body in a field. When the boyfriend returned to the scene of the crime, he found blood on the ground and Vasquez missing. The following day, police arrested Esparza at his place of work in Lakewood. A few hours later, Vasquez's body was found in a field near Alessandra Boulevard and Merwin Street, Moreno Valley. Authorities have recovered a weapon they believe is tied to the crime in Esparza's 2013 white Toyota Tacoma truck. It appears to be a random selection of a victim, Whittier Police Chief Aviv Barr said. There is no known motive. There is no apparent or known connection between the suspect and the victims. Esparza has been ordered, held without bail pending a preliminary hearing set for October 25th. If convicted of the charges against him, faces up to a live sentence without the possibility of parole. Man, how are you going to leave your girlfriend there to get killed and raped, bruh? What the fuck? Damn. Do something. Oh. <sighs>